In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to recover your photos and videos off your SD card. Now, if you guys don't know already, um, your photos and videos are usually stored in the gallery application. Now, say you've deleted them from your gallery right here. We're just gonna go ahead and delete them all. Um, they are usually going to be in the trash bin. So if you guys want to recover your photos for any reason, they actually do stay in here for about 30 days um, and sometimes even 60 days for some devices like from OnePlus and other stuff like that. But as you guys can see, our photos are in here. Now, say you've went a step further and just left those in there for 30 days and you couldn't find them um, or you just deleted them by accident, we're gonna need a little help from our sponsor at Tenorshare because they are not on our phone's SD card anymore as you guys can see. So a huge shout out to our sponsor at Tenorshare 4D Dig. If you guys wanna go ahead and download this software, I'll leave a link in the description down below. Also use my code for 30% off and that will be in the comment section and the description down below. But this software is a little up there in price, but this is gonna help you recover videos and photos um, of some memories that are probably worth way more than that. So to go ahead and recover those, we're actually going to take the SD card out of our phone right now, and we are going to actually hop over to the computer. So go ahead and take that SD card out. We're gonna go ahead and remove it. Now the software is going to work on Windows and Mac, so uh, they have you covered for both of those. But let's go ahead and hop over there. All right, everyone, so once you have the application downloaded, make sure that you do put in your SD card before you open the application uh, because it won't recognize it. So we put the SD card inside the computer and we've opened up the application. Next, we're gonna go ahead and click on your respective SD card. So this one is going to be called USB Drive F. So we're gonna go ahead and click on that. And we're going to go ahead and rescan now. So we've actually scanned this before, but we're going to go ahead and rescan it again. And for the sake of this video, I didn't pick videos or documents or anything like that, but it supports all of these file types, which is actually really cool. And we're going to click on photos and scan only for photos. So go ahead and click scan only for photos. If it's just for photos, our scan is going through. This is kind of like a deep scan. You can you can stop this if you want to, but most likely our files are already recovered. So we're going to go ahead and click on the tag files right here. And we're going to click recover. And uh, it's going to ask you to please select a path to the recovered files. Uh, don't restore files to the portion where you lost data. So we're going to go ahead and just keep a separate file for a desktop and we're going to click recover then it's going to ask you to recover only or recover and repair um, and for this one i'm just going to click recover and repair it should only take a few seconds for photos as you guys saw but we're going to go ahead and view the recovered photos and it's going to be saved right here camera samsung and here are all the photos that we needed. So we have all of the photos recovered. And uh, if we wanna go ahead and put those back on our SD card, all you have to do is go ahead and put these to the side. Forgive me, my desktop is super dirty. But we have a file right here that was saved to our desktop, which is always great to see that it's super organized. And uh, if we wanna go ahead and put these all back on our SD card, all we have to do is go to a removable disk. We're gonna go to DCIM, our camera, and of course, just take all of these and pop them back on the SD card. That is if you do wanna view them on your phone. Some of you don't even have to view it on your phone, but we're gonna go ahead and take the SD card out of our PC right now and pop it back in the phone. All right, guys, so we recovered the photos. We put them back on the SD card and we're just gonna show you right now. Um, we don't have anything in the gallery, um, so not lying or anything, but let's go ahead and open up the slot right here. And we're gonna go ahead and put the SD card inside of that slot. It is now popped in. Under photos should pop up in a second. Let's go ahead and pop back into the gallery. And there you guys see all our photos are now recovered. Great to see it. But uh, yeah, this application works perfectly. If you guys wanna go ahead and download it, obviously I'll leave the link in the description down below. And I have a 30% off coupon as well. But that is how you recover photos and videos on your phone's SD card. But this has been Safan from TechRite. Peace out, Tech Gang.